NFL Draft first round recap. Bryce Young was the first overall pick. I believe the Carolina Panthers made the right selection, but they are not the story of the first top 10. The Houston Texans doing what I thought they would do with the Bears, but they did instead with the Cardinals, which is picking two picks within the first three picks. With CJ Shroud and Will Anderson, they jumpstart the rebuild under D'Amico Ryan's great job. Houston, kudos, way to use draft capital. Anthony Richardson to the Colts is gonna be great. He fits that Shane Steichen scheme perfectly. Devon Witherspoon to Seattle. Seattle knocked it out the park in the first round. Paris Johnson to the Cardinals is very solid. Bijan to the Falcons is a hand and glove fit. Jalen Carter to the Philadelphia Bulldogs, uh, we'll see. And Darnell Wright to the Chicago Bears. We will be averaging 30 points next season. Please be ready for that. Okay, picks 11 through 20. Broderick Jones to the Steelers was a great pick. Christian Gonzalez to the Patriots was a fantastic value pick. Fantastic. The Detroit Lions, though. <laughs> As a Bears fan, you guys talked a lot of crap on Twitter, and you draft Jameer Gibbs a round early. You could have got him in the second round. And Jack Campbell, middle linebacker, in the first round. Trash. Now, Seattle getting JSN at pick 20 is probably my favorite. It's close to my favorite pick in the first round thus far. The Emmanuel Forbes pick is just as bad as both Lions picks combined. Forbes is a good player, but you could have got him later. Should have traded down. Scaranci is good value at number 11, plus it's a perfect fit for Tennessee. McDonald, Van Ness, Cansey, all reaches in my opinion. We'll see how those work out. I don't hate them, but I don't love them. Now the end of the first round, love Quentin Johnston to the Chargers. I also like Zay Flowers to Baltimore, especially if they trade for Hopkins. We'll see. Addison to the Vikings is a reach. Good job, Vikings. <laughs> Giants, Bills, Cowboys, Jags all made solid picks, but the steal of this back half was Miles Murphy to the Bengals. Crazy value there. Also, I love how Philadelphia continues to build the Philadelphia Bulldogs. We're going to see how that works out for them, but Nolan Smith was also great value at the back half of the first round. Brisset was perfect for the Saints scheme, but I mainly want to talk about how the Steelers are going to get Joey Porter Jr., tomorrow with the first pick so they got their offensive tackle and they're gonna get joey Porter jr this is ridiculous what is going on in pennsylvania they they're running the draft right now them in seattle and the texans so some of the players i can't believe didn't go in the first round is brian branch michael mayer i just spoke about joey porter jr donnell washington i think is very slept on the tight end out of georgia osiris torrance i understand but will levis what happened Will Levis was supposed to be one of the guys. It just goes to show you how draft hype and a good marketing team can make a lot of noise, but maybe not lead to the proper results. I, some of the teams that passed on Will Levis in the first round, Tampa Bay, Tennessee Titans, the Washington Commanders. I mean, what are you all doing? Detroit, if that's what you all were gonna do, you might as well have drafted your quarterback of the future. Uh, Seattle, I can understand because they had an awesome first round. But the rest of you guys, not sure what's going on. Or maybe Will Levis is just not ready. But let me know your thoughts on the first round of the NFL draft. What you felt about the pick your team made. What surprised you? What didn't? Who had the best draft? What do you think is going to happen tomorrow? Let me know in the comments below. And as always, find that red button and subscribe. subscribe.